a time to look hopefully ahead to future when the problem which face the world today will be seen in their true perspective. Her late majesty, Queen Elizabeth II, 1972. Good morning to our respected judges, our teachers, our friends, and to the participants here. Thank you very much for coming along here today. Before we start, I would like to ask you something. What do you think about English? What do you think about the language itself? Is it difficult, hard, complicated, or maybe ugh, it's a boring thing? But today, I will change that thinking. If you are talking about English, many people will say that's a boring thing. But for me, that's an art. According to the languagegallery.com, to the statistics shared by Babel Magazine, English is spoken by 20% of the world's population. Based on ETLAC data, English is the most widely used language in the world. Estimate that at least 45 countries use it. It is recorded that 1.45 billion people will be speakers of this language by 2022. From this data, we can say that the English is used by many people for everything. That's what we are going to discuss today. Everything with English. That means English is a universal language. Universal is general or applies to everyone or to the whole world. And language is a system of arbitrary sound symbols used by people to collaborate, interact, and identify themselves. Therefore, language can also be called a communication system used by human. As the most used language, we need to learn, acquire, and study about English. Besides learn about English, we need to try to say it to communicate with English. Why we have learned about English? First, linguistic barriers. Linguistic barriers cause miscommunication problems when people from different states and countries cannot understand the language of others well. English tops the list when it comes. What is the most used language in the world? What is the most popular language in the world? Based on surveys and extensive conducted by the British Council, it was found that the number of non-native speakers who use English as a second language is greater than native speakers. Second, the internet. The internet changed the world and opened portals to communicate to various corners of the world. Most of content shared on the internet is in English. All computer hardware and software is written and programmed in English. Third, English is a universal language itself. According to spaskabi.ua.ec.id, English is one of the oldest languages in the world and originates from the British Plains, namely the 8th century. Apart from English being the oldest language in the world, English has a very rapid vocabulary development. According to joint research team Harvard University and Google researchers, recorded the addition of the vocabulary of the world oldest language has reached 8,000 and 500 words per year and now the number is 1 billion and 22 thousand words how English is amazing isn't it everywhere and everything with English even with our little thing called the phone we can find many people use English just open your Instagram setting with English film with English information with English even song with English do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's life you can wait. Do you want to learn English language? <laughs> Before I close my speech, I would like to give you my conclusion that English is a universal language and we need to acquire, learn, and study about it. B.J. Habibi ever said, learn to be strong from the bad things. To your life maybe that's all for me and thank you for your attention